artists, performers, and food trucks, the Blue Dome Arts Festival offers a more grassroots feel for those looking for something more local this weekend. And 2 News reporter Jamil Dunneth has the scoop on what the event has to offer. Hi there again guys coming to you here from the Blue Dome Arts Festival in the early morning as we turn to some of the artists here who are setting up and I'm joined here by Yusuf who's doing pottery. Talk to me a little bit about how long you've been doing your, your craft. I've been doing pottery for about 25 years now. Um, my studio was uh, originally in McAllister, Oklahoma here and I've just recently moved to Tulsa and working with the Waterworks and um, art studio here in Tulsa, yes. Very beautiful creations here. And now, as I understand it, you've been coming to the Blue Dome Art Festival since its beginning, right? Yes, I've been coming to the Blue Dome Art Festival um, since 2000-something. Um, I can't remember right now. It's such a long time since. Mm. And what keeps you coming back? The crowd, the people, and um, the setup is pretty nice, and that is close to uh, close to heart here for me as far as um, Tulsa is concerned. Um, my, a lot of my family lives here, my wife and kids and all that lives here in Tulsa, so it's, all, it's a nice place to come and do show. So really quickly, how have you guys been doing this weekend? You've been selling a lot? This weekend has been very nice. The crowd has been very good. The weather has been very good. Um, at least I think at least 40,000 people passed through here um, this past two days that we've been here. So very nice show uh, so far. Wonderful. Well, there you have it. Lots of success here at the Blue Dome Arts Festival. And it kicks off at 11 a.m., goes till 5 p.m. tonight. So make sure you get down and check it out. We'll send it back to you guys in the studio.